welcome everybody back for some more Timborn Season 2, The Iron Thief. Probably getting to the end of this series now, unless you guys have any other ideas of what I can do. There's a couple of things that I can think about doing, and that's I kind of want to make this a little bit bigger and a little bit more damn like so. After this drought, we're going to whack this up to two and a half, which would be good. And actually, what I'm going to do is sort of build this up and, and, and make that a little bit better and um, see what we can do. First of all, let's see how far this reaches and where they can build the mine down there. Obviously, we have the mine that's over here. I've currently paused it so we can build up a bunch of stock for it. But what we can also do is actually place the mine just down there onto this. Obviously, this will be uh, controlled and maintained by the timber bots, but obviously the beavers from this district here can start doing that. We've got obviously 18 timber bots chilling, and obviously they are being produced and made over here in our little timber bot area. Now, I'm not 100% sure exactly what I want to do with this series anymore because I wanted to obviously get a bunch of stuff done. I wanted to dam that up and uh, I wanted to actually create a bigger thing over here and sort of control a little bit better. But I think this district over here is pretty good for food and water. Now, um, obviously, I, I think I messed up slightly in the waterfront. Yeah, obviously, they're building up a bunch of supply. We have 0.5 days to go. And obviously, we have like a relatively big... Uh, influx of water back here as well sort of about that deep and a little bit more as well but the next thing I wanted to do is see if we could um, make that a little bit because I think we can make it a little bit deeper And uh, get up here, do some demolishing of this bit here, which will get us up to there, and maybe get us into the water. So, what do we need to hear? So, we've got obviously potatoes over here, they're obviously going to be planted and harvested eventually. We can unlock that and put some bots in both of these, I believe. Um, I'm going to just set them so there's one bot in each for now. Obviously, they work 24 hours, so not too worried about those guys getting a little bit ill. Injured, I mean. We'll go through and pause all of those throughout the dry season. Obviously, we are sort of struggling for water, but hopefully we can always pump some more in the long run. Now, obviously, we've got the this over here which obviously takes the treated planks and stuff obviously we got tons of bot parts absolutely loads of bot parts and these guys are just building them up over time and time and time which obviously means that we can probably start sending bots over we've got 20 bots now which is crazy see we're in this dry season and this is all the water we got. That's getting built up with gears and treated planks. I just don't think we have enough power. Oh, that's where all the timber bots are in there. I see. But yeah, everything looks pretty good. I think I've basically unlocked everything that we need. There is a couple of things I want to do is the like the gravity battery, which I kind of want to stick over here. Maybe like one there. Not that way around though. Oh, 
proceed and I'm going to store like tons of power. But also, do apologize about the motorbikes. So, they will get built up over time. That's some gravity batteries over there. We should probably also get some gravity batteries over here. But to do that, we do actually need to make a little bit of a um, path. I'm not sure if I want to make the path. No, we'll do it this way around. Do one that goes up over. We also need to go up there as well. To place in some dynamite. also place in those gravity batteries now. Obviously this will take a little while to build but hopefully it should be worthwhile in the long run. There we go. And then we can obviously do a corner and then two straight in there and then eventually we'll get all this built up and everything will be good to go on this end I think they're focusing on this for right now prioritize bunch of this stuff first because we should have the resources for them and um, we do have a spare timber bot now as well that guy can go in there oh we don't have any logs over here Crazy. Distribute logs. Oh, we are distributing logs. Oh, but there's zero logs over there. Interesting. Hmm, I thought there was loads of logs. I didn't think we were struggling for logs, to be honest with you. But apparently we are. Well, we can always prioritize doing that. Let's see, demolish this. Mark like all of those. Put that in there. That'll give us some logs. Place a staircase there. Hopefully they can reach that. Yeah, we are using like a bunch of wood for like not necessarily important things. Obviously, this dude's going to be like mental and he's going to carry like two logs at once, absolutely fill up that thing, and then he has to run all the way back to get power. Uh, 
There's going to be a bunch of stuff that need to do, eh? And the fact we're kind of running low on water now is kind of a little bit of an issue. Two. Oh, uh, we're doing 24 hour working as well. Just didn't realize we were also doing. Yeah, that's something we don't really need to be doing, is it? I kind of want to be able to get over here. Start dealing with those, but. We got four days of drought left. <laughs> yeah, that's all the water gone. But everything stayed green, so that's okay. Because I feel like that's kind of more important. Obviously these guys are turning planks into stuff and then these guys are turning the logs into planks and then Yeah, well, a couple of these maples are coming in nicely, so. We stay in that bot over there, and he's going to be cutting down the trees on this side, getting all those um, maples 24-7, so. So he can take out twos at once, he can carry two. So he's going to be more productive going over there than going elsewhere. We are kind of at a point where we just have to sit and then wait for stuff to be done. We start building some of these. It's going to take a lot of planks, so. But I feel like building it is better. This is not think where I can put it. Obviously somewhere where. It will help them. get all the beavers as well. I feel like they probably got more planks over here. No, not really. But apparently they can build that one on there. Logs are going up. They're almost done, so they're going to get a load of wood too in a minute, in a minute so... I'm still waiting for planks and stuff. Just a lot of prep.
Oh, these are why, because the bots are working. They're like crazy speed. Oh, I know. I was going to say dry season's over, but it's not. It's just the water receding. Oh, signing. Let's put the damn bees down here. Yeah, I should be able to reach that. I think three logs down there as well. Quite low on wood. Mm, water's good as well. Pretty low on water. Obviously these are drying out, so they're like 10% grown, but they're also drying out. Obviously we've only got 1.1 days left. And these take... That's where all our wood's gone. Into engines. Yep, that's where all our wood's gone. Let's get all those unpaused, ready for the next day. Obviously, they'll probably pump all that water out, but eventually we'll get it back up. Yeah, because we put so many uh, engines about in it that a lot of it was just like lacking power. no water. Beavers are going to start dying of dehydration. Come on, drought. End. Drought has ended. Water is coming back to the land. Luckily, I don't think we've lost anybody from dehydration quite yet, but. Ah, that's also where all our looks are going. Pause that. I'm not really even at that point where we can even get that really going. Let's get this water going quickly before people start dying of thirst. And obviously power's now back up.
and that's all back up so that means that um, we've got all the wood from that which means we still have zero with three wood over here and um, these guys have zero but these will start finishing oh what are you ah, some of them need to dry up and now we're struggling for water Yeah, pretty high priority for those buildings, please. A lot of beavers just died of old age as well. Not good. Not good at all. But I think that's where I'm going to leave this episode today. I mean, we've sort of planned out where these things are going. The beavers are building stuff i got we got to work out a plan for wood in the next episode obviously these are being built up and, and flanks are probably going in these yeah i'm 109 going in here so obviously we are building stuff that's going to use a bunch of wood basically so we it might be worth just sort of expanding out and uh, planting some of these these trees, the birch ones that take only nine days, just sort of slapping them in like that. Which I might just do now. Obviously all of it's marked. Maybe unlocking that and then putting the priority up. Nice. And then that means that um, it'll all get built up quickly. And it, all the trees will be planted nicely. Uh, yeah, some of these are being done now. Getting done now. But I'm going to play with this a little bit off camera. Make sure that everything's going well to plan, basically. And uh, yeah, I'm going to leave it there. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.